Okay, this morning I shall um, share with you some information on how to grow Japanese pumpkin. So first of all, you get hold of the seeds and then you put them into a pot with potting mixture and lots of moisture. Put the seeds inside there and after a few days, this is what you get. The seedlings will all come out, they will germinate and then this is how they look. They're so pretty. And then now is the time for you to transplant them into your garden. Most of the soil in the garden is not naturally very fertile. So what you need to do is to dig a hole of uh, where you're going to plant the, uh, the pumpkin and then uh, you dig it deep enough so that uh, you can replace the soil with some potting mixture, this black potting mixture. Now this is where you have already filled it up with the potting mixture and now it's ready to be transplanted into this uh, plot. It is always a good idea to spray some water into this potting mixture because you're going to sit at the bottom of the, the hole and uh, sometimes they don't get enough moisture. By doing this, you are making sure that the bottom is nicely moisturized and ready for the roots of the uh, pumpkin to grow into. So, we are now ready to um, transplant these uh, seedlings into this uh, the hole that we have prepared. And so the way to do it is to make sure that we dig around this plant, this seedling, uh, making sure not to damage its roots. Okay, and then after that we lift the, the plant together with the soil and put it into that um, hole. Okay. Okay, so we have successfully dug out the seedling from here and then we have put it onto the ground. And right now we, we, spend, we make sure that the plant is in the center of the hole and after this we're going to fill it all around with a potting mixture. So what you do is you get this potting mixture and then you top it up around the plant, spreading it equally so that the plant is uh, in a vertical position okay so now your plant is ready uh, to grow on its own and uh, you've got to look after it for the next two three months before you can get the fruit after you have put the um, soil around you need to uh, then make sure you have some water over the um, the, the plant and the soil above is, is moist and wet right so that uh, it will be uh, it will not dry out but the weather today looks like it's going to rain but never mind uh, just water the plant and make sure that there's enough moisture all around So now all the four seedlings have been uh, transplanted into the ground and uh, the next thing to do is to look after it and water it uh, preferably twice a day if it's a very very hot day but of course if it's a rainy day then we just uh, leave it at that okay so let's hope that this plant will grow and uh, over the next uh, few months bear some Japanese um, pumpkin bye bye